This screencast will demonstrate reading your email in the new Yahoo Mail using a screen reader. For this demo, I'm using JAWS 12 and IE9. In Yahoo Mail, you can press the M key to navigate directly to your inbox. Since this is a keyboard shortcut provided by Yahoo Mail, you'll need to bypass JAWS virtual cursor by pressing insert 3 before the M key. The inbox is organized as a table. So after you press the M key, the inbox will load and focus will be placed on the first row of the table. As a result, JAWS will read the columns in the table from left to right so that you can know the sender, subject, and date of the message. So I'm going to press insert 3. Enter key to pass through. And then I'm going to press the M key to navigate to the inbox. Table Facebook Stephanie Shum posted on your wall. App 30, 2011. Navigate the messages in your inbox by pressing the up or down arrow keys to move focus to the next or previous row in the table. As a convenience, Yahoo Mail will automatically toggle the virtual cursor off for you when you're in the inbox, so there's no need to bypass the virtual cursor before pressing the arrow keys. So I'll demonstrate simply navigating between the first three messages in my inbox by pressing the down arrow key. Facebook Stephanie Shum posted on your wall, App 30, 2011. Table Chris Naughty did you sign the Royal Wedding Guest Book App 29, 2011. Table Addie Lee Brownie says hi App 29, 2011. Open an email by pressing the Enter key. When the message opens, focus will be on the message header, and JAWS will begin reading the email header information followed by the message body. So I'm going to open this email from my friend Addie Lee by pressing the Enter key. Enter. Brownie says, hi, hi, sender, recipients, and date from colon at ile324 at yahoo.com to colon a milfin at yahoo.com message flagged Friday, April 29th, 2011, 12, 24 p.m. table. Application, Brownie. So you'll notice that um, JAWS started reading the header information for this email message as soon as I opened it. Um, it's important to note that since email messages are documents, Yahoo Mail will automatically toggle the virtual cursor back on for you when you open a message to make it easy to navigate the message content. And each message contains at a minimum two level three headings, one for the subject, another for the body. This makes it easy to quickly move between the header and the body when you're reading uh, your email. And of course you can always use the arrow keys to read your email line by line. So I'm going to press the um, three key to navigate to the level three heading that represents the message body. This message contains blocked images. Heading level three. Message body heading level three. Okay, and then I'm just going to use the um, down arrow key to now read the rest of the content of the message. We got back from our Hawaii vacation and Brownie was looking particularly adorable. Link http colon slash slash www.flickr.com slash photo slash add ile slash two billion eight hundred seventy three million nine hundred forty addy blank. So I'm finished reading this email from my friend Addy and I want to read the next email in my inbox. Yahoo Mail provides a really helpful keyboard shortcut for doing that, which is control period. I can also press control comma to read the previous email. So I'm, I want to read the next email. I'm going to press control, period. Corn at the Children's Discovery Museum, I Center, recipients, and date from colon at ile324 at yahoo.com to colon at corn. So that's another email from my friend Addy. I'm going to press control, period, again to see what the next email is. Photos from the cooking class, I Center, recipients, and date from colon hilaritasers at yahoo.com, photos. Okay, so this is an email from my friend Hillary. I'm going to press the 3 key again to move to the message body and read this message. This message contains blocked images. Heading message body heading level 3. And I'm going to use the down arrow key again to read the contents of this message. That cooking class was great. Thanks for arranging it. We had a lot of fun. The photos are on Flickr here, colon. Link http colon slash slash www.flickr.com blank. Enjoy. Hillary. When you're done reading your email and you want to return to the list of messages in the inbox, you can do that by simply pressing control backslash. So I'm going to press that keyboard shortcut now, so control backslash. Control backslash. 
Table Facebook Stephanie Shum posted on your wall. App 30, 2011. App. And you'll notice that when the message tab closes, focus is now returned to the list of messages and uh, focuses on the first message in the inbox.